So I feel like someone is seeing you as good news because you are in this emperor's energy. Now, you could be a divine feminine or a divine masculine. You could be this person's child mother or you could be this person's child's father. But they are seeing you as good news. They see you as very loving, very kind, very beautiful and things like that. And with this seven of cups, I feel like this person wants to come back in because they want you to be one of their options again. So they're seeing you as one of their options. And that would be good news to them if they could come in and get you in a repetitive cycle. Now, with this Queen of Pentacles being at the bottom of the deck, this person could actually be married. This person could be married to a Taurus, Capricorn, or a Virgo. And they are trying to keep that a secret. With this High Priestess energy, they're going to keep that a secret from you. So let's see what else is going on with this person. So definitely be careful because they want to have a new start with you with this Ace of Wands. But they could be hiding the fact, definitely, look at the Moon card here. They could be hiding the fact that they are married or they do have someone else. So let's see. What is the message, please, Ancestor Spirit Guides? We do have understanding. So I feel like this person is getting the understanding of why you are not with this person. I feel like they are seeing your side of the story now. You know, they're seeing where you're coming from and the reason why you left. With this new chapter at the bottom of the deck, I feel like you are just moving on with your life. You know, you're trying to move on from this situation and trying to heal from this situation. But this person is going to try to travel towards you or try to contact you. Could be online with this eight of wands energy. Look at this. Definitely trying to reach out to you. Definitely trying to travel towards you. They want to keep you stuck in some kind of karmic cycle with this devil card energy. So be careful. They want to keep you stuck in some kind of cycle. They want you to be one of their options, maybe a mistress, like a third party or something like that. This person is still in some kind of player energy with this Knight of Wands. So definitely be careful. They see that you are moving on. Let's see what else we have here. Too many. What's the messages, please? So yeah, this is all to try to keep you trapped. Like I said, they want you to be one of their options. We do have reflection here. I feel like this person did get some kind of clarity when it came to you when you walked out of their life. I feel like things haven't been the same since you've been gone. And that's why they want your energy back. We do have indecisive. Like I said, this person has someone else in hiding in the background. So be careful. This person did not want to make a decision between you and someone else. So let's see. And they still don't want to make that decision between you and someone else. It's still the same. What else do we have? What else do we have, please? We have broken. So this person is feeling really broken that you're not in their life. Like I said, they want your energy. They want your recognition. They want to be around you. They want to be in your space. They think about you all the time with this daydreaming card and they long for you to be in their life. But you have laid this to rest with this four of swords because this, whatever this person was doing behind the scenes really messed up a foundation with this tower energy. You found out something about this person. You know, you gained clarity about this person with this eight of swords. You did. You found out something about this person and it was just too much chaos with this five, five of wands here. It was just too much, too much drama dealing with this person. And you know that, and they're going to try to come in to try to hold you back with this four of pentacles. They want to hold on to you. Look at that. That's crazy. Look, you made a decision to be single with this two of wands. Look, this uh, Knight of Pentacles and this Two of Wands, you made a decision to be single. You're very abundant, very beautiful, doing things alone. You made that decision. You move forward with the Six of Swords. You know, you left this person behind and this person was in their ego and they let their pride and ego get in the way of this connection. So don't allow this person to come back. Let's see what else we have. Neglect. Look at this. They neglected you. They neglected your needs, what you wanted, and things like that to entertain someone else. You know, and they know this. This is no surprise to them. They missed the opportunity with you. And they know they missed this opportunity. But they're still going to try to come in and try to confuse you like they didn't. Let's see. Let's get one more. You could be a Libra, Aquarius, or a Gemini with this King of Swords at the bottom. Let's see. One more, please. All right. We have our last one. This person is overwhelmed here. You know, being away from you has overwhelmed this person. You probably were the one keeping this person together, doing for this person, making this person look good. You know, now they don't have that in their life. Whatever person they married or went to, are, they're not you. They don't hold the same energy as you. You are the empress. You are the emperor. 